What's up, everyone? Welcome to Union Gaming. This is your host, Roz. As always, like the video, share the video, and hit that subscribe button. And final disclaimer, please monitor what your kids watch. There will be adult language and possibly adult content in this video. Not saying your kids can't watch. I'm just saying be prepared for questions they may have. Alright, so this is part 5 of my Unmetal playthrough. I want to throw a quick shout out to Turn of the Century Gaming. Uh, Mike from there is the one who turned me on to this game. He is also doing a playthrough, so after you watch my video, head on over there, check him out, subscribe to his channel as well. So here we go. Alright, uh, another thing I want to tell you guys is I am currently using a gamepad which is a little bit fucky for me because I was using a key okay I can't get through there all right now I gotta look for a key key card that someone may let me borrow maybe that chick doctor will I got plenty of I got plenty of uh, first aid kits. They better let me use a lot more first aid kits if I have to rescue. Oh. I didn't go up here at all, did I? Bullets. Bullets. I finally had a gun. Now I could kill those guards. That is, if I were an assassin and didn't promise the doctor I wouldn't murder anyone. So if I shot someone, I had to use a first aid kit to heal them before they bled to death. So you really didn't kill anyone? Of course not. I'm not an assassin. <laughs> the gun I found was empty but it had a 10 bullet magazine. So, I loaded it up with any bullets I found. Hey Fox, are you there? Here I am, Robert. Hi friend, how's that escape going? Still alive and free, so far. Hey, how did they catch you? I was in the outskirts of Katsala taking some pictures of a bunch of military trucks. There was too much security. They were obviously hiding something. I couldn't clearly see what they were loading, so I got closer. Turns out, I got too close. Next thing you know, I was surrounded by a bunch of pricks aiming rifles at my head. Did you at least manage to see what they were loading? Sure did, but I was disappointed. What did you see? Concrete. Concrete? Are you kidding? Two huge rectangular concrete blocks. Each could barely fit into a truck. You were imprisoned for a piece of concrete? Fuck, man. I'd be disappointed too. <laughs> too much security for something so mundane. But enough about me. You should get back to your escape, my friend. Lord of the Bullets. I'm gonna wait for this dick here. I shot a guard. I couldn't let him die. I promised it to the doctor. I had to heal him before bleeding to death. 
So I got close, and I used one of my first aid kits. Got more bullets. That's cool. I heard something. I heard something. Level up. Fantastic. Tiger punch you. You may push me instantly close. Nice. That's the one I want. Got plenty of bullets now. Colonel, do you copy? Copy. I found more documents. They look like... a list of coordinates. Coordinates? Of what? This document is encoded as well. I don't know what the coordinates are for. Huh. They could be strike targets. Those bastards could be planning to attack us. Alright. So this does not look to be like the place I need to be. So up here. Just making sure. Do I have any? This is Jesse Fox. Over. This is the doctor. Over. What? Doctor? But how? How is the escape going? Just fine. Trying to find a way out of this building. Well, my access card won't work. It's only clearance level two. Leaving the building requires level 3 clearance. Where would I find that? The officers would have them. Their offices are on the third floor. Wow, thanks for the help. I didn't know you cared about me. What I care about is that you leave ASAP so I stop getting so many patients. By the way, what's your name? My name is Doctor, over and out. Name is Doctor. Fox, do you have what you need to leave? Not yet, Colonel, but a contact told me where to find an access card. A contact? Yes, a doctor. A doctor? Give me a description. She is smoking hot. <laughs> oh, for God's sake, control your hormones, son. We're in the middle of a very serious operation. Listen, Colonel, make no mistake. I'm not in any operation of yours. Nor am I any of your soldiers. I'm only trying to escape from this damn place. Damn it, Jess. Don't you realize this isn't an escape, son? You must realize Operation Jericho could end up with countless casualties. And it's your moral duty as a citizen to prevent it. Prevent it? Me? Is that a joke? Yes, you. Search every damn office in that building. For any information you can prevent that damn plan, over and out. Thanks, dude.
didn't get into that. We'll probably have to go up another floor here. I'm 98% sure if I go in here, I'm gonna fuck things up, so I'm just gonna go up. That requires level three clearance. Thermal sensor. Those thermal sensors had a detection angle of 90 degrees. And it would sense the heat of my body, like the Predator. They obviously wouldn't detect through the tall brown boxes in the facility. So I could hide from them like how I've been sneaking around the guards. But the containers weren't everywhere. Any wide open areas were a problem. That's when I thought to call the Colonel, where I'd learn a way to trick the sensors. Colonel, do you read me? Loud and clear, Fox. I'm on the third floor. This is where the offices should be. Search for more files. We need more intel about the attack. That's not going to be easy. In the middle of the night, those offices should be empty. Haven't seen anyone yet, but there's a thermal sensor. I can't proceed without setting it off. Do you have any ideas? In the army, we use insulating suits to conceal our body temperatures. <sighs> insulating suits. Alright. So, let's go back down. See if I can figure out how to get through this little, uh... little thing here. I got a feeling it's down in here. Why did you keep punching those crates? What did you expect to happen? No it wasn't wise to use weapons there. Okay. See what we got in here. I got nothing in here. Got nothing in here. I'm gonna go back down. I no, nope, can't get through that way. All right, I gotta figure out how to get through this shit. Avoid doing that again. Alright, let's just run through shit. these things. Cool. 
cool. Study your enemy. Wait for the best time to strike. Got it. Guess I can just shoot the fox. That might be easier. now. Shot right in the fucking head. <sighs> yes, I know I can use the potty to quick save. Alright, so I'm getting the hang of this. Fox here. Over. What is it, Fox? Colonel, I'm still searching for the officer's office. You're gonna see me nerd rage here pretty soon. It's okay, I got this. Because, you know, attempts equal views. yet. I'm gonna just get in here. Get up here. noticed a few abandoned crates that were thirsty for some punch. They seemed easy to reach. That is, until the containers started to drop. Mega draw. <laughs> Until it does like a phase two bullshit. I noticed a few abandoned crates that.
simple. Easy. Boss defeated. This is Jesse Fox. Over. Doctor here. Hey, Jesse, I need a small favor. Uh, favor? Of course. The guards you injured on the first floor just keep coming in. Can you find a less vicious way to handle them? Not that I care, per se, but I'm getting a little overwhelmed here. Oh. Sorry, Doc. You can count on me. You're drooling. Uh... What? Oh, sorry. Her voice was so damn sexy. Is my voice not feminine enough for you? Well, it's girly, of course, <laughs> but... Oh, shut up. Continue your story. Find a non-violent way. Collateral damage. Yeah, I got the thermal suit. Let's see where this goes. I climbed down into a pokey little room that seemed to be stocked with a lot of chemicals. I could brew up some chloroform to put the guards to sleep and score points with the doctor. Hold on, you have expertise in chemistry? Chemistry's not that hard. You just have to mix the ingredients correctly. So I got sodium. Water, sodium. I got chlora. I got more chlora. I got four. All right, so I got. I got form and combined with chlora. Okay, so now I can uh, find my non-violent way to deal with guards. A guard with his back turned was listening to music. It was the perfect chance to test out the chloroform. I just needed to sneak up and put him to sleep. This is a lower level. Cool. Bullet slot. I don't know what that means. Probably means I can probably hold a different kind of bullet. Ah, here we are. This is the room that I was in earlier. couldn't get through. Alright, so did I want to go up? Yes, I did want to go up, didn't I? You know what? Let's go clear out all these, clear out all these drones here. You know what, I'm going to use my little piss pot. That way... That way if something bad does happen... I did clear it out. 
Let me reload. Now, now I'm wearing like this sexy uh, stealth suit. Which I'll probably overheat in, the way this game goes. I knew better than to punch while wearing the suit. It was delicate and could tear. Bad news, no punches while wearing the suit. Good news, scoring more points with the doctor. Okay, good to know. Alright, I can get up here a little bit. I can avoid this thermo energy imaging section. Need that key card. the battery for. Huh. stupid all right so this is probably where I'm gonna end this video I'm getting pretty sleepy anyway guys so I will see you guys later thanks for watching again this is Roz with Eonian gaming hit that subscribe button it's over here in the right hand corner of your screen it is the icon of my channel like and share the video comment let people know about me Appreciate the support. Catch you guys later.